Hi guys. I have one more story that I'm able to read today during nap time while Millie's sleeping. I think she's going to wake up soon. Um, so let me try and get this one in. Um, yes, I'm still in my Manning Oak sweatshirt because this is the same day. I've recorded three today and I will do more um, a little bit later. So this story that I have for you today is called The Bad Seed and it's written by John, by Dory John, who is the same author as the one we read earlier this week called Giraffe Problems. Um, so I wonder what this story is going to be about. The bad seed. He doesn't look like a very good seed. The back blurb has some other nuts talking about him. There is a bad seed. He's not so bad. Let's see who's right in the story. Okay, the bad seed. Oh, yeah. Oh, I think I skipped a page. I did. I'm a bad seed. A bad seed. He looks pretty bad to me. He looks pretty unhappy. Oh yeah, it's true. The other seeds, they look at me and they say, that seed is so bad. When they think I'm not listening, they mumble. There goes a bad seed. Oh, they look afraid of him. They're scared. But I can hear them. I have good hearing for a seed. How bad am I? You really want to know? I want to know. He looks pretty bad. Well, I never put things back where they belong. I'm late to everything. I tell long jokes with no punchlines. I never wash my hands or my feet. Ew. I, I lie about pointless stuff. I cut in line every time. Yep, I agree. Bad seed. Making some bad choices. I stare at everybody. I glare at everybody. I finish everybody's sentences and I never listen. And I do lots of other bad things too. Know why? Because I'm a bad seed. A bad seed. See? He's bad for sure. I just can't help it. Sure, I wasn't always this bad. I was born a humble seed on a simple sunflower in an unremarkable field. I had a big family, seeds everywhere. We found ways of having fun. We were close. Oh, look at all those seeds. They're having fun and they're happy. It's kind of a blue. Oh, I think I skipped the page. I did. But then the petals dropped and our flower drooped. Oh no. That the problem's about to happen. This is when he must have turned bad. He started out good and then he turned bad. It's kind of a blur. I remember a bag. So sunflower seeds, delicious. Oh no, he's gonna get eaten. Everything went dark. And then, then, oh no, what's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? What do you think's gonna happen? A giant! There's that sunflower seed bag. He's putting one in his mouth. I thought I was a goner. I thought I was done for. I screamed and hollered, ah! But, but I was spit out at the last possible second. Phew. I flew through the air and I landed under a, the bleachers with a huge thud, thud. When I woke up, it was dark outside. A wad of gum had softened my fall. I felt okay, but something had changed in me. I'd become a different seed entirely. I'd become a bad seed. So this is the part in the story that he's telling us where he was good and then he became bad. I wonder what'll happen. A bad seed. That's right, I stopped smiling. I kept to myself, I drifted. I was friend to nobody and bad to everybody. I was lost on purpose. I lived inside of a soda can. I didn't care, and it suited me. He looks lonely when he's bad like that. Nobody wants to be around him. Until recently. I've made a big decision. I've decided I don't want to be a bad seed anymore. Yay, he's changing. I'm ready to be happy. It's hard to be good when you're so used to being bad. But I'm trying. I'm taking it one day at a time. That's all we can ask him to do. Right? You just try your best. Sure, I still forget to listen, and I still show up late, and I still talk during movies, and I do all kinds of other bad, other bad stuff. 
my character is changing back to good again. But I also say thank you, and I say please and smile, and I hold doors open for people. Not always, but sometimes. At least he's trying, right? And even though I still feel bad, sometimes, I also feel kind of good. It's sort of a mix. All I can do is keep trying and keep thinking, maybe I'm not such a bad seed after all. Hey, look, there goes that bad seed. Actually, he's not all that bad anymore. I heard that. So cute. I love that story. Um, so hopefully you guys at home are thinking about good stuff to describe you and good ways that you can be nice to people and helpful and not be the bad seed because um, it seems like nobody wanted to be around the bad seed. And of course you want everybody to be around you and spend time with you. So make good choices and be nice and sweet to everybody. And I will be back soon with another story. Bye.